Royal watchers who are hoping to get the first glimpse of baby Sussex as Meghan emerges from hospital may well be disappointed, royal commentators have claimed. Speaking in the podcast on air, British correspondent Emily Andrews and American commentator Omid Scobie, reported that Harry and Meghan are not planning an on-the-steps moment with their newborn. The Duchess of Cambridge delivered all three of her children at the Lindo Wing, and appeared on the steps looking picture perfect each time, just like her late mother-in-law Diana, but apparently Meghan will not follow suit. At the moment, we understand that she isn't, she doesn't want to do that, isn't going to do that, Emily said. Oma added that it would go against Meghan's feminist beliefs, saying, given what we know about Meghan, the optics of a totally glamorous, picture-perfect moment hours after giving birth are not quite in alignment with her views on the world. There might also be simple, more practical reason being the lack of post-birth media appearance, Meghan might very well forego the Lindo wing at St. Mary's Hospital altogether. Emily said she has been told a birth will not happen at the Lindo wing, but said Kensington Palace refused to confirm this. For each of Kate's births, the council put parking restrictions in place around the Lindo wing of the hospital. This time around, however, the council aren't aware of any parking restriction for the street facing the Lindo wing in April. Omid suggested that the couple might have selected a private hospital closer to their new abode, Frogmore Cottage in Windsor. We are operating with a 23 miles radius of different locations, he said. Recently, Sources claim that the Duchess of Sussex will opt for a maternity unit near to her and Prince Harry's home in Windsor, Frogmore Cottage, to avoid the stress of the massive global interest in her pregnancy. And Meghan's decision to rebuff St. Mary's Hospital's famous wing is also reportedly so the mother-to-be is not seen to be copying Kate. Harry and Meghan realize there is intense public interest but this baby is not a direct heir to the throne and they want the birth to be as private as possible the source told The Sun. Meghan is nervous about complications such as an emergency cesarean and doesn't want the pressure of having to look immaculate on the hospital steps just hours later. The source said that the Duchess of Sussex did not want to be primped and blow-dried to within an inch of her life immediately after giving birth but wanted to spend the precious time with her newborn.